<laughs> we are no Jedi. Welcome everyone, this is Master's Joke, also Master's Joke 75 on Instagram. So today I'm opening up my bargain of the uh, century, <laughs> Star Wars, the Black Series, Princess Leia, lightsaber. So this was, I mean you might have seen my previous video, but this was um, being advertised on a website called Bargain Max. Never heard of them. Good, they had some, they had, um, Good and bad reviews, more good reviews than bad reviews. Um, and on the reviews, every time someone did say something bad, they they'd say, how, you know, contact me, let me know how I can help. So I, w I was quite impressed by that. Um, so this was being sold for ninety nine pound ninety nine. I signed up for a for a mailing list, got ten percent um, discount code, so I got it for um, eighty nine ninety nine, ninety quid for a black series lightsaber. And currently, I mean, I checked the website today, they're still selling it, and at the moment it's been sold for £89.49, so, so like 50p cheaper than I paid. Absolute bargain. Um, brand new box, sealed. Just, there's just like a little ding. I showed it in the last video. There's a ding on the... Oh, I'll, show, I'll, I'll show it. There's a little ding just on the corner of the box. But that's it. That's 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 all. That, that's the only um, the only issue. Not enough to send it back. I, I do. I don't keep all my uh, boxes, but I do keep my lightsaber boxes. So yeah, not not a major, not a major concern. Um, and I'm going to open it now. Now um, I like the Rise of Skywalker. It's not the best film in the world. Doesn't make any sense, but it's full of nostalgia. So I like it. I enjoyed it when I watched it in the cinema. Was it back in, was it 2019 I think it was? And um, I did like seeing Rey Skywalker's lightsaber, as well as Princess Leia's. Rey Skywalker's lightsaber was the first lightsaber I ever bought. Also my, <laughs> also my first ever YouTube video. So, you know, check it out. But I thought this was a bargain. And um, I'm going, you might, again, you might have seen it. Um, in a previous video. I'm going to Galaxy's Edge next month. I can't wait at all. Um, I haven't been to a Florida since 2019. Um, I did have a holiday planned for the 31st of March 2020, but it got cancelled for obvious reasons. And one of my plans, um, I was going to, um, well, we were planning to go to um, Anaheim in like, we didn't book anything, but October... 2020 it was just you know go for a week just to visit galaxy's edge because it's um not as well not as busy but you know that didn't happen because of uh you know the uh cl the world closing down for like three years but i planned to buy um ray skywalker's lightsaber there the disney one so when that didn't happen that's when i treated myself to a ray skywalker lightsaber and i haven't looked back because i love them so I've been looking at a lot of uh, Disney vlogs, and I was watching Ordinary Adventures. Uh, it, was, it was quite an old, an old vlog, but it was a uh, Galaxy's Edge in Anaheim. That's where they're based, and um, they were showing off the Disney um, Leia lightsaber, and I thought it looked amazing. It's got like the um, the kind of uh, Mother of Pearl and the rose gold. I think it looks great, and I, I especially like the rings, where the kind of the blade. Um, shows through so I mean even though it was still up in the air I wasn't sure if we were going or not I ordered this and obviously because I was at work my wife took delivery and she wasn't happy she knew exactly what it was because she bought me the, <laughs> the Luke Skywalker lightsaber for my birthday a few months ago but yeah I'm really looking forward to this I mean 80 so it's £89.49 at the moment I mean that's a bargain and you can still sign up they sent me another 10% code for my next purchase. So if you want it, let me know and I'll send it to you. But this is this is absolutely um, amazing price. So I'm going to get it open and um, have a proper look. So let's let's do that now. Right. So I'll just cut along the uh, the tape here. 
and then the contents, it should be on like a kind of tray. Right, so it seemed easier. When I, when I opened the last couple of Black Series lightsabers, it did seem easier to kind of get the contents out. But this is what we're, this is what we're dealing with. I mean, look, look at that. So well packed. There's the lightsaber there. So what I'll do, I'm going to get the, uh, I'm going to get everything out, and um, let's uh, let's set it up. So check out Princess Leia's lightsaber. It's absolutely beautiful. I mean, the, the camera doesn't do it justice. It just looks amazing. It's a lovely design, and the rose gold. I mean, yeah, it is a bit girly, but if I was a Jedi, I wouldn't mind having this one. It's honestly, it's, it's so much like Luke's one and Obi-Wan's, but there's also a bit of um, Anakin Skywalker about it as well. I absolutely love it. And I'm so glad, I'm so glad I, I bought it. I got it at such a good price as well. So it comes with the, um, it, it comes with the extra accessory. So this is the uh, fatter bit. So you can, when you put the blade on, or you leave it on the uh, on the fin, the fin bit if you're um, having it on display. But I mean, look at that. That is beautiful. The rose gold. Um, it's very pinky. Such a lovely, such a lovely colour. The um, mother of pearl. I know it's not re re really mother of pearl, but. That does look a little bit naff, if I'm honest. It doesn't look great. It looks better on the box, but I'm not gonna moan at that price. Love the shine on there. And one of the things I love is the weight. I like a heavy lightsaber. And to be honest, Luke Skywalker's lightsaber was always my favorite, because my nan got me, when Return of the Jedi came out, she bought me a, a lightsaber, and it had an orange handle with a sticker made of Force Be With You on there. So I don't think it was a fish. It wasn't official Kenner or anything like that. But um, yeah, Luke's has always been my favourite. But my Luke one isn't as heavy as this. I'm just, and that's with batteries in. So I'm just going to get my Luke one, just to compare it. It's just over there. Yeah. So so Luke's one is is relatively light compared to this. But um, yeah, I like the way it's it's shorter because. Obviously, one's for a delicate lady. <laughs> the other one's for for Luke Skywalker, Jedi Knight. But look, yeah, similar in design. But I actually like this better, I think. So that is really, really nice. I love it. I absolutely love it. And then let's put Luke's one here. But that is that is great. It's just so nice. Yeah, it's got just, just such nice um, detailing on there. Come on, well worth £89.49. Let your eyes be your guide. Just a beautiful lightsaber. So 
So yeah, brilliant, brilliant lightsaber. Great weight to it. And then I've got my Anakin Skywalker Legacy lightsaber here. And this is from Disney. And this has got a nice weight to it. I really like this lightsaber, the original. So yeah, Dis Disney do some really good lightsabers. I sort of think I prefer the um, Black Series ones, but yeah, Disney do all right. And also, and they do some good deals throughout the year. And also I've got, well, I've got this new lightsaber coming uh, from Galaxy's Edge. So I've not decided what, what one I'm gonna build yet. So I think you've got four choices or four themes. I'm obviously gonna go for Sith, I think. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this is, this. I, lo I love all of these. I'm a little bit addicted now. So, so the Princess Leia one will be my, well, it's, it's technically my fourth lightsaber, but it's the fifth one, because I, I bought Darth Vader's Disney lightsaber for my son when I bought this one. I couldn't buy one for myself and not for him. But yeah, no, they're all, they're all great. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the blade on, so I'll exchange it for this part here. I'm gonna put the batteries in and um, see how it sounds and looks. But very impressed so far. Lovely shine on that uh, that rose gold. Absolutely love it. So for this particular lightsaber, Chuffy Futter, I'm not going to read the instructions. I've left them in the box because I think I've opened enough lightsabers now to know where the batteries go and how they work. He says. Right. So let's have a look. So. I believe that you just screw this um, bottom part down just to get the battery out. And on the um, on the Hasbro back on the Hasbro lightsabers, you do need to um, use a screwdriver. I don't remember though. So according to this, because I remember, so I should have read the instructions, shouldn't I? On my on my Luke and my Ray Skywalker lightsaber, you took the um, battery compartment out and then you had to unscrew it so you could put the batteries in. But according to this one, you unscrew one of the screws on the actual handle. So, so that's, that is new, but that's kind of like a nice little touch because these screws are just for, these are just for show, but this one's actually, this one's actually got a purpose, which is a nice bit of design there, Hasbro. Right, so that's that screw's been loosened. So this should come out. Right, so that comes out. Do you know what? This is the easiest one um, I've kind of dealt with. So that's the battery compartment. So there's no small screws or anything. I think. On the other ones, I think that hole there was where the screw went, but there's, oh, maybe that's where the screw goes into. So it takes three batteries, so I've got my Duracell ready, which, which actually uh, matched the lightsaber. So let's put these in. Right, so, so I'll need to line it up again with the uh, screw here. So that should go there. And then screw this back on. Yeah, that's a nice little touch. I like that. I really like that. I love the weight of this. I think it's great. Right, so what I've noticed here, this screw here has come loose. So I don't know, I don't know why that's happened. Do you know what, I think that's a button. Right, so <laughs> again, I should have read the instructions. I was thinking, why has that screw come loose? Straight underneath, but 
I'm assuming that must be <laughs> that must be a button. Oh, I love a surprise. <laughs> right. So now let's um. Oh look. Right. So now let's take this bit off. Right. So that comes off there. Now does. Oh, it looks awful, doesn't it, with the big fat bit on top. So I'm not sure if the blade goes in first. I'm just going to check that out. Right, so I've got the blade here. So if it fits in the hole... Yeah, so it, does it fit? No, it doesn't. It doesn't. Right, so the blade... The blade does go on first. And if it's like the, like the other ones, you just put it in and twist. Right, so, that, so that's on. That's all on there. And it's just a case of putting the, uh, the top bit over the top of the... Uh, the actual blade. And then that just goes on there. But straight away it doesn't look as elegant with the uh, the wider bit on the on the top of the lightsaber handle doesn't look as good but let's let's um let's turn it on oh. look at that oh it's got a different noise as well because you only saw it you only well oh I like it it's got I love it, and you know, you know what I was saying, where you where you can see the blade through the uh, through the rings. That is amazing. I love it. Look at that. That's a beautiful lightsaber. I like the noise as well, because you. Um, I, I actually <laughs> I watched the Rise of Skywalker again, because I like it, and because I, I wanted to see at the end when um, Ray has um, she has Luke's. Or Anakin's lightsaber, and she has um, layers. I wasn't sure which one she projected using the Force um, behind Kylo Ren's back. So I watched it again, and the one that Kylo Ren has is the um, is the Anakin Skywalker one. So the one that Rey uses against the Emperor is Leia's one, and then I think she ends up with both lightsabers to defeat the Emperor by sending his, you know, his lightning back at him. So yeah, but I, I watched it because I wanted to find out. Oh, it's, it's beautiful. So what does this button do? All right, so it's got the, uh, quite difficult to focus. Oh, I like, I, I do like, I like the noise. But what I need to do, because it's, uh, it's daylight at the moment, I need to um, have a proper go at this. So there's only, <laughs> there's only one way to do this. I need to, I need to um, have a proper go in the garden when it gets dark. So um, I'll come back to you in a moment. I have been every voice you have ever heard inside your head. Have you come to destroy me, Obi-Wan? I will do what I must. <laughs> What can I say? This is absolutely amazing. 10 out of 10, 
bargain max. Let your eyes be your guide. Don't forget, you still get the 10% um, discount if you sign up for Bargain Max's emails. £299 on Hasbro Pulse for this uh, Leia Organa lightsaber. Definitely not worth it, but 90 quid. I mean, look at it. Absolutely fantastic. Really, really impressed by this. I love the weight of it. I like the different noises on there. Uh, one of the things, that I'm, one of the negatives I've just, I have noticed playing it in the garden is the back button, which looks like a screw. I do, you do tend to touch it accidentally when you're holding the lightsaber. But yeah, I absolutely love this. It's just, it's just fantastic. You've, you treat yourself to see stuff. Forget about the Easter eggs. Treat yourself to a lightsaber. But anyway, that's the end of the video. My next lightsaber video will be coming live from Galaxy's Edge next month. So watch out for that. I've got no idea what I'm gonna be building, but it should be good. But yeah, that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. It also helps the channel. And I'll see you in the next one.